both power wheels loaded we gotta go pick up trevor hey so what's the reason for having to push the gold wing into the trailer hey so i called you 30 minutes ago <laughs> You're still not ready? What do you mean I'm not ready? I have everything packed. Juan John's here filming me while he could be helping me carry my helmet and stuff out to the truck, but he's like, no, we gotta make content. <laughs> Ooh, man, I'm squatting. I might need some, like, new shocks in the rear. Jeez. I remember last year I had the Bronco and a side-by-side -side for the races, and I don't remember it being that squatty. Oh. All right, Juan John, what are we doing today? Up the core, Kawasaki is. Hey, don't do that. It's looking as good. Yeah, I got the gold wing. We got the Bronco. This road is really tight. Try not to hit this device. 30 points. We're going to pass this. Pass him. Uh, isn't there an oncoming car? What's the Bible verse of the day? Um, putting you on the spot. Uh, I am putting you on the spot. Uh, trust in the Lord with all your heart. Do not depend on your own understanding. Believe in Him and all you do. Uh, what's the rest of that? And He'll make your path straight. Amen. What? What's the reference? I, I, isn't that trust in the Lord with all your. I'm trying to think back to like the the scripture memory songs that we used to do in uh, Sunday school. It was like. Um, watched our other video you can see the the river there that somebody went off into in the middle of the night went inside the river is that right trevor yeah he went for a swim but like it's kind of dark out and it's like you know generally you don't want to take your car with you when you go for a swim unless you take your gold wing with you which is what i like to do Yeah, I was like right up on this road right after this turnout. So we're stuck here for like ten minutes watching this guy yeah. coming out of the creek. Yeah, I get a towel it's on straight everything. Cliff right there. Yeah, it is like straight drop. That is Just not a great downhill. Man, that's that is not a that's not a fun ride, is what that is not. That was not fun. But we, we finally made it. Yeah, buddy. After two hours. It's windy. Let's start her up. Since your neighbors aren't here. Wah wah. I hope it starts. I haven't started it. It's a Honda. Man! Honda, baby!
one John does not like washing things. <laughs> so we're out here. Gonna go back to the pits and unload the Bronco and race it. Yeah, right now they're on Sportsman and then it's four minutes and then run with the Bronco. Yeah, we're uh just moving here. Kind of a scary whoops, kind of a scary vehicle to ride faster in, but we've got a nice hand grip here. I think your gold wing is actually more comfortable than dumpster rats. Well, yeah, it's a, it's a touring bike. That's what it's built for. <laughs> We're built to go 90 mile an hour down the freeway all the way across America. Here's Alexander. I gotta go say hi. Why are they loading up their freaking Jeep, I wonder? Uh -oh. I think this exhaust fell off. Oh, yeah, I think it did too. Oh, man. That is not a ride, this is for the faint of heart. Let me tell you. It keeps falling off. Yeah, uh, we could mention in the comments that you should put grease pants on. Yeah, that'd be dope. I had a magnet right here. Oh. Hmm, like a neodymium sort of. I might have to put like three magnets. I would just do pins, dude. Everywhere I go. Yeah, well you should you should you should hood pin it. He is running a little lean. Running him 32 to 1 right now. Mm -hmm. And now he's running a little bit better. for these folks that they uh, ride safe and have fun and uh, heads of protection. Amen. Amen. And when? Pizza Hut. Oh. Go, go, go. Yeah, buddy. Maybe it is your battery. Battery or what? Am I good to get out? Uh, hold on a second. Does it start? No, it doesn't start on battery. Am I good to get out? Yeah. <laughs> my terminal came off, so that's why I was like, doing <laughs> shit, it kept cutting power. Really? You're yeah. what? My terminal, because I don't, I'm missing a bolt for the positive oh. side. So it came off, so I lost all power. <laughs>
Right, yeah, I'm recording. Drive over here. trying to find a bolt for it. Okay, they were trying it. to find a bolt for the ranger, whatever. Anyway, but I, I, I knew that last time Juan John missed it too because he was working on the dog, or he had to come check on the dog, which that makes sense. But I was like, why don't you give Owen your phone preemptively before, so you don't, and he's like, no, nah, I'll be right back. I'm going to go do that and whatever. That was my intention. Be that back in two intention. seconds. But I got, in two seconds. hey, do you have tools? Do you have bolts? I'm like, uh, I might. Let me see if I can help you. Did you or did you not buy a taco? And then I, and then I, yeah. And then he bought a freaking taco. I, I had so. to eat, dude. I was, so, I was low on fuel. Bro, low on fuel, I was low on the pain threshold is what was happening. Man, no, it wasn't even bad, but I, I dropped the Goldwing like three different times. Um, yeah, the, something about the track this time was like, it was way too slick. Like there were spots of mud and water and it was like, for, for a bike, the track's just not designed for it. Especially one without rear brakes, I can't stand on the rear brakes and stand the bike up. So I laid the bike down like on three separate occasions. One time I went like all the way around a circle and kept on going, sort of, but... Anyway, the last time was arguably the worst because right crossing over the finish line, it wasn't my finish line, but it was right by the finish line. Uh, the bike got all wobbly and I was like, well, I guess I'm going down. And then the bike went down and yeah, I, I went through the windshield. So so we have the windshield, it's gonna get hung on the garage wall and the bike still runs, the bike runs amazing. So I guess we're gonna take a UTV takeover here in a month and uh, see how she does. Classic Honda, baby. Classic Honda, it's been reliable. Although uh, I have not been a reliable owner necessarily. Ah, it's a Honda. It's good. Yeah. If you haven't already, like and subscribe. Trevor is putting a paddle on his Goldwing, and I will have a 1972 Ford Courier trophy truck. And that's a video you definitely do not want to miss. Hey, Trevor, what? you finally cleaned your windshield. <laughs> yeah, it's very clean. Uh, yeah, I'm actually going to look for a, a details partnership or something like a partnership we can do. Make your windshield look as good as mine. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah. You got a car behind you. Yeah. I need to put on a helmet. 
Oh, you cracked your windshield, dude. Where? No, no. <laughs> On your Audi. It was already cracked. Oh, it was? Okay, cool. Yeah, I'm on my brew Thank you very much for watching. If you haven't noticed, Trevor and I were wearing the Motorsports for Christ merch. Make sure you check that out. All support is much appreciated. God bless.